Live from Las Vegas, it's theCUBE. Covering VMworld 2017. Brought to you by VMware and its ecosystem partners. Hey, welcome back to VMworld 2017. You are watching theCUBE. We have had a very exciting day one. I'm Lisa Martin with my co-host Dave Vellante. And we'd like to welcome our next two guests, Tim Breeden, the Senior Director of Data Management Software at Dell EMC. Welcome to theCUBE. Nice to be here, thank you. And Sal Damasi, Director of Data Protection Solutions from Technicore. Hello. We're excited to have you guys here. I think we've all discussed, we all, ha all had about the similar amount of caffeine today, so this is good. <laughs> so, um, Tim, first question to you. So, some big announcements today on day one. Um, data protection suite for apps. What is that, what was announced, and how does it differentiate Dell EMC? Yeah, very exciting. So, uh, if, I, if I fall into saying DPS for apps, you'll have to forgive me, it's kind of the vernacular. But what that does, it's, it's the culmination of a lot of hard work. Uh, in particular with VMware products providing some differentiation, certainly around backup performance um, and, and further automation across the entire VMware stack itself. So a huge differentiator for what we're selling now uh, against traditional sort of deployments is a, an automation end-to-end uh, -end in the stack from your, your control to your um, data path right through to the back end storage. Um, and then of course, uh, today we announced that uh, with AWS Cloud, um, uh, Dell EMC and VMware Cloud has partnered, um, and uh, Dell EMC being the first partner uh, with uh, AWS in that regard. So data by its very nature is quite distributed, so when I hear you, know, you can basically protect anything anywhere, I get excited. Yeah. So is that the un underpinning in, of the philosophy? And I wonder if we could talk a little bit more about that. Yes, uh, we want to be able to protect anything anywhere. We also want to be able to find anything anywhere. So if you put our product into your environment and you say, hey, I have a lot of stuff. It's just sort of point us in the right direction. We'll go and find it and we can automate protecting it so that it's not, again, I kind of pull it back to the previous um, way, the traditional way uh, that deployments have happened in data protection. Um, if, if a new VM, if a new VMware VM uh, pops up, we can simply discover it, add it to a protected group, and your data protection is there. So again, comes back to the, to the automation. So find it everywhere, protect it everywhere. How far do you, do you take that, you know, today and even in your vision, in terms of, I mean, you see a cloud, SaaS clouds popping up everywhere. I sometimes get concerned in our own organization about how are we protecting the data in this application versus this application, or what if something goes wrong? What if we want to switch yeah. SaaS providers? Can you help yeah. me with that problem? Yeah, and that's part of the evolution of the DPS for apps. Right now, as uh, some folks know, kind of a start, but there's a cloud tier in data domain itself uh, that, that we can exploit. Um, but you know, right now, if you think of the, the applications, the application governance, uh, the VMware support, the self-service model that we have, it's the natural next extension into the cloud, not only protecting to the cloud, but those cloud native applications that we'd protect as well. well Sally, I wonder if you could talk about your organization uh, as a Dell EMC partner, a long time EMC partner. Um, what's happening with your company and your customer base? Sure, thanks. So Technicore is uh, just about 10 years old. We've always only been a, uh, well most recently Dell EMC partner, but traditionally EMC only partner. And uh, it's, it's, it's been a very good relationship thus far. Um, our, our company started off with a, a healthcare only practice where we specialize in the Meditech space, but we've grown, in, we've grown into all verticals of the market. So, you know, commercial, higher ed, utility companies, pretty much wherever, wherever customers find a need, we're there for them to, to help them through it. You guys have a great, um, a, some great use cases uh, on your website. I was particularly interested in the one of, with the Royal Victoria Regional Health Center. Knowing HIPAA in, in the States, there's obviously other requirements in Canada, um, and patient data being so sensitive. Tell us a little bit about some of the business outcomes that RVH is, is, is leveraging using the Dell EMC technology provided by Technicore. Sure. So, Royal Victoria Hospital, they're a fantastic customer. Uh, prior to Technicore being engaged with them, they were, they're running a lot of old, antiquated hardware and software, which, you know, up until the last couple of years was, was doing well for them, but 
you know, now in these days, IT and the business, they're, they're best friends, right? IT's been enabling businesses to generate revenue, to provide better patient care, better expectations. So we helped them pretty much transform their whole data center into a, a modernized data center where we used data protection suite for, for VMware to dramatically improve their, their backup speeds. Uh, being a Meditech integrated, certified integ uh, integrator, we were able to transform a lot of their Meditech workloads onto modernized flash-based technologies and really change the way they offer care to their patients through faster x-rays, faster backups of VMs that developers could use for, for R&D and you know, just an overall much more better experience, not only for the business, but for the customer, the, which are the patients. Excellent. Tim, how do you look at your portfolio from an engineering standpoint? You've got a vast portfolio, you know, EMC and now Dell EMC. What's the, what's the strategy from an engineering standpoint to bring all those pieces together? Yeah, there's definitely a, a best of both worlds or a synergy in combining all of these things, right? I mean, you've uh, got EMC with a heritage, you know, from storage and the data protection very established over time. Um, you know, Dell brings to the mix a few things, but one is, is uh, there's strong um, hardware server, uh, you know, technology there as well, where an exploration of, you know, how does the data protection software necessarily fit with that? How do we put these things together? Um, one thing is, 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 is for sure is that it, from an engineering standpoint, it takes a little bit of time to figure it out, but there's always that excitement sort of sitting out there that you, you want to jump into. But I think overall, we've got continued opportunity uh, with that to, to go right to what Sal's talking about here. The, the RVH sounded like a customer in desperate need of that SDDC, Software Defined Data Center, right? And so we placed that bet on things some years ago, and now we're seeing it all come to fruition, you know, with the more implicit scaling capability and the performance scalability. So I think the, the goodness of the, that Dell presence and, and wanting to be number one in everything, combining with this EMT, EMT skill set and, and technology and proven team that, uh, you know, between that hardware and the software at Dell EMC, it's a fantastic opportunity. One of the things that we've talked about before is, is that data protection is not just a, an IT problem, it's a business problem. Mm. How do you guys work with, and may, maybe you both could answer this question, not being customer facing, how do you work with IT and the business to align, to really, with RVH as an example, really show the business the impact that multiple copies and proliferation are making. How, how does that alignment help? How do you help with that? Well, the largest challenge customers face, not only in the healthcare space, but in every other vertical, is the ever-growing number of virtual machines in an environment. Every time there's a virtual machine, it's of some importance, it needs to be protected. The business expects everything to be protected. They expect everything to be retained for extraordinary amounts of time. And the way we found a way to provide a, a solid message to customers is to show customers the value of the cost to serve model that data protection solutions by Dell EMC offer them. So, you know, lowest cost per terabyte for storage, fastest times for recovery, the ability to manage the data through a life cycle, move it to different places, different ways. You know, offering the business flexibility and peace of mind at a, at a value is, in terms of cost is what they react to the most. How about the whole channel dynamic? Um, when Dell announced that it was acquiring EMC, you guys announced the deal, as always, the channel freaked out a little bit, and then <laughs> it was, you know, there was some concern, some friction. So I think just last week, Michael Dell was on the cover of CRN, mm -hmm. like with some real kudos mm -hmm. as to how that was figured out. I wonder, Sal, if you could take us through sort of what your experience was. Sure. So, in all honesty, it's been a pretty seamless, a seamless move over. We're, we're really impressed. You know, there, there's always the slight hiccup here and there with, uh, with that kind of transition, but overall, it's, it's been a good experience, at least for Technicore it has. We, you know, a, a, a lot of us being familiar with uh, the not only internal EMC processes, but Dell processes before they became one, helped us become a little bit more adapting to the situation, but we've, we've not only feel that it's better, 
it's, it's overall a much more positive experience because of what Dell brings to the table now with the merger, so. And, and we, the disruption to your processes has not been uh, an no, issue whatsoever. No, not because at all. The mindset of Dell is, you know, huge volume, EMC, very high touch, even though you're a massive mm -hmm. company, but you haven't right. seen any effects of that. No, I think Dell, which is now Dell EMC, they've done a really good job at understanding the legacy EMC experience and making sure they didn't deviate far from that when, when they became one company. So they strategically made sure that these people from this organization are still going to be involved, they're still going to be the ones you go to, and then as time moves along, they're finding different ways to improve processes and, and overall partner experience. Excellent, well, congratulations on your continued partnership Thank with you. Dell EMC. Tim, congratulations on the data protection suite for apps. Thank you so much. The differentiation there. We thank you both for spending time with uh, us on theCUBE today. Thank, thank you, you. Thanks, you're guys. welcome, right. thanks. And for my co-host Dave Vellante, I'm Lisa Martin. You're watching theCUBE live from day one of VMworld 2017. Stick around, we'll be right back.